The Beagle Harrier is a French sandhound with loyal, determined, lively and playful personality. There are top 10 interesting facts about the Beagle Harrier. I would love to thank these Instagram profiles for letting me use their photos in this video. If you would like the Beagle Harrier and you would love to see more of it, definitely check them out. Links are in description. Number 1. Separate breed. The Beagle Harrier is very often mistaken for an oversized Beagle or pretty small Harrier. It's true that they have very similar appearance and the main difference between all three breeds is their size. But the Beagle Harrier is a separate pure dog breed that is officially recognized by many kennel clubs, including the FCI, and it has its own breed standard, breeding stations and breed clubs. Number 2. Origin the similarity with beagles and harriers is not just some lucky accident. It's very possible that the beagle harrier was developed as a mixture of these two breeds or as the midpoint in breeding between the two breeds. This happened in 19th century in France and the person who is credited for developing this breed is prominent French painter Baron Gérard. There is another theory that says that this is very old dog breed which is in existence since the late middle ages and whose ancestry is unclear. Number 3. Utilization The main original utilization of this dog is of course hunting. When on the hunt, these dogs are very passionate for it and they show great intelligence and independence, strong prey drive, endurance, great sense of smell and great determination for the hunt. The Beagle Harrier oftentimes hunt in packs and they typically do not have problems with other dogs. Overall, this is a very good scent hound. Number 4. Companion of course, the Beagle Harrier is not only a hunter but also a very lively, friendly and affectionate companion dog. This breed typically creates a very strong bond with its family and they want to be part of your all daily activities. These dogs are also known to be very good with kids and other dogs and if socialized from the puppyhood, they can even live with other household pets like cats. But it's still a hunting breed and I would not suggest to leave small household pets alone with the Beagle Harrier as the dog might chase the other bad. It's just their natural instinct. Number 5. Not for everyone. Even though the Beagle Harrier is an affectionate and loving companion, it's still not a dog for everyone and it's not the best choice for novice dog owners. It's because even though this breed is very intelligent, they also have mind of their own and they are quite independent, which means that they are not total pushovers to train. Independent breeds always need extra patient and consistent trainers to show good results in obedience training. This breed is also known to be pretty vocal, they have higher exercise needs and they have higher prey drive. All those traits can be a little bit challenging for novice or an experienced owner. But with the right owner who have time for the dog and who like long outdoor walks, this might be an excellent partner. Number 6. Size as you already know, this breed looks like a large beagle or small harrier and indeed, the size is just in between these two breeds with the average height between 45 to 50 cm, which is 18 to 20 inches and weight between 19 to 21 kg, which is 42 to 46 pounds. There are no extreme size differences between males and females. Number 7. Exercise as you can probably imagine, these dogs are very lively and they have rather higher exercise needs. The Beagle Harrier definitely needs daily longer outdoor walks accompanied with some vigorous playtime and fun training sessions with a lot of rewards. Without enough exercise, these dogs can develop some unwanted behavior such as excessive barking or digging. If you want to have healthy and happy Beagle Harrier in your home, then regular exercise is absolutely essential. Number 8. Coat the Beagle Harrier comes in the great looking tricolor which is fawn with black blanket and white. They can also be a little bit grey. The coat is practical for the hunt and it's very thick, relatively short but not too short. Number 9. Maintenance Speaking of the coat, it's important to mention the maintenance and grooming as well and luckily it's not a hard task with this breed. These dogs do shed, so regular brushing is beneficial to remove the dead and loose hair and minimize the shedding. Regular brushing will also remove any dirt from the coat and keep the coat in best possible condition. No other grooming is required. Just like with all dogs, you should regularly check the dog's ears, eyes, nails and teeth and clip them or clean them if needed. Number 10. Health 
This is a relatively healthy dog breed with good lifespan around 13 years. These dogs are prone to some joint and bone problems such as hip and elbow dysplasia and intervertebral disc disease. Other health issues may include patella luxation, some eye problems or some allergies. Tell me in comments what do you like the most about the Beagle Harrier and what is your experience with this dog breed. If you are new on this channel consider subscribing, turn the notifications on and check the Rocadox links in description. Thank you for watching, see you in the next video.